So here we're just going to take a look at the separator. The separator is a benefit where we've got large volumes of dust uh, and or we've got large chips from a plane or a router and we fill the bags really quick. So the idea of that, it separates the large chips to the fine dust, large chips go into a bucket, the, all the dust extractor has to take in is the, the finer dust there. So we've got it where it locks directly onto the, onto the extractor. We've got a 20 litre centre tub. Now the centre tub can be either filled directly into or with the unit you'll get a bag. And then the, this is particularly to bring it up to an M-class rating. We can fill directly into the bag and then after that we can wrap that up we can dispose of it. So there's a couple of different things. And also the lid that goes on the tub, and this is just to seal it on site. So we can buy those tubs separately if you want a few different tubs on site. And the other fitting that comes with it is this one. And the idea of that fitting is this is our standard fitting with the two right angle adapters. Where we need to fit into the MIDI, we just change one of these, take that off and we change one of those. And then that'll locate into the into the MIDI to then bring this, make it work with the separator. So that's just what the the other fittings for. So with the standard CT26, the 48, so it'll fit all the dust extractors except for the H-Class. So it's not approved for H-Class. So what will happen here is the separator on top. So what happens there, that the dust comes into the unit, gets separated by this, the heavier chips drop straight into the bucket and then the fine dust gets sucked up through here. And then we just use the extra hose to lock that directly into the unit, close that down and then on here it's got a couple of little pictures saying hose side, dust extractor side and then that will go onto the end of our tool, bring that in, separate the dust and away we go. So it's just a, a really good way of being efficient with bags but also to work with large volumes and dust and that type of thing. So some of the time with M-Class, the alarm will come on and it's because there's a setting that's not correct. So when we're using an M-Class extractor, we've got a, a 32 mil hose here. If we open the, the top here, we've got a little scale and it'll just tell us that if we're using a 27, a 32 or a 36 mil hose, I'm using a 32, it's three and a half metres long. So I need to have the flow sensor setting on 36 for this to then measure correctly. So that's easy enough to go down to the to our flow sensor and this represents all our diameter hoses. Normally if I wasn't using a separator on a 32 mil hose I'd have it set on that but all I do is go up to the 36 and that ensures that this measures it correctly to keep you safe.